Welcome to the second week of 2021 I'm sorry I didn't update yesterday I was just so out of it and it was so hectic and this is the sound of the kettle but anyway uh, the first week was already hectic enough and it was filled with historical event actually I have a really busy week I have an assignment due I have a midterm I need to film I need to edit I want to finish Warstone finally I want to start one of the 12 books that I chose to read and I made it like a tbr jar yesterday if you saw and i want to start and finish love and focus which is a really short manga series it's supposed to be really cute so i will finish making my coffee while waiting for the kettle to burn and then i will update you more later my coffee is done and yeah let's go and talk my god i love these filters these snow filters they're saving my life because i really don't want to put makeup on so yeah i hope you guys don't mind and my coffee is done and let's go talk about some manga and some books i actually ordered manga so i don't know if they'll arrive this week but let's hope so and my eyeliner keeps moving that's amazing it's better lighting here i suppose so yeah welcome guys to the second week of 2021 so about what I have to do this week, like I said, I have to do a, really a lot of things. I have to finish but an assignment. I have an assignment due this week, but I really want to finish it today. I am supposed to write about uh, autoantibodies and rheumatology. It's kind of hard because I have to do a lot of research and I actually need to do them from like official books. Like I just can't go into Wikipedia and just write whatever. So we're using Trusty Robbins, I'm using Nelson as well, I'm using Kumar and Clark's for clinical medicine and I'm also using a book of aromatology, I don't remember the name of it, it's called ABC of Rheumatology or something. Uh, so yeah, I have to finish that assignment and then I need to study on for my midterm that is on Friday. So this is for school work, uh, so yeah, I wrote half a page yesterday, I don't know amazing so but i really want to finish it today today i don't have lectures in the mornings but i have lectures all afternoon this is why i want to finish the assignment right now in the morning i actually woke up at 5 30 i've been doing that this week and it's kind of been working i hope it lasts because i'm a, I'm a night owl and that never lasts so for school that's it i actually started why are you that this weekend the previous weekend and i've been watching like an episode a day while, while eating breakfast i just watched an episode it's kind of dumb like i see the appeal you know you just watch it when you want not to think about anything because there is no narrative no real story it's just a bunch of cuteness and fluffy things and so yeah i watch it to unwind uh, I've been watching like an episode a day. It's been really fun. I see the appeal of Zipra and Saint and why everyone's watching it for them But it's the left cheek dimple and height difference for me sci-fi zone all the way. Tell me down below what? Who's your ship and what are you watching at the moment? I really want to start Fire Force Season 2 as well, like one of the plans for this week was to start Fire Force Season 2 I also really for reading plans. I want to finish Warstorm. This it's so embarrassing, you know, like it's so embarrassing. This has been on my TBR for the longest time and I've been just showing it like guys I want to finish this. But anyway, I am almost done. I'm done. Like <laughs> I have this much left. We're getting there. We're getting there. It's getting kind of interested. It's just that I I'm so over YA fantasy for some reason. 
and I really want to read this. She has a new manga coming this summer as well and look at these covers. So yeah guys, these are the plans for this week. Video, oh, I have to film and edit as well, but that's like, I'm just gonna put them somewhere during this week. Is the thing is, it's so easy to film for me and because I usually have a lot of things to say, but it's the putting makeup and actually dressing up for me that's just <laughs> Putting makeup in this pandemic has been such a struggle. Uh, so yeah, these are the plans for this week. I hope you have a wonderful week and without further ado, let's get the assignment writing starts. I I really want to finish today. Like I don't even want to procrastinate more. Let's just get to it. Let's just get it done. Bye, bye, bye. I'm gonna go right. Bye. Against the FC portion of immunoglobulin G and different RFs can recognize different part of immunoglobulin G F C RF. And immunoglobulin G join to form immune complexes that contribute to the disease process. These antibodies are immunoglobulin. Grocery shopping with my parents because they're going now, so I think I'm just gonna go with them. Mommy, I didn't kiss you, but it's obvious I wanted to. Bubble gum down my throat, and it's a curse, but my luck couldn't get any worse. Cause I swear we are Myself, since it will be so entertaining for later years when I have to write even harder. Well, how about you and me? I mean, Thank you. 
good morning hello lovelies how are you i just wanted to update you guys i in all honesty there's nothing much to update I, but i'm still not even finished with the first volume like only that much through because i just don't have time i've just been really studying for my midterm which is tomorrow so i only have today to finish it up i did watch start uh fire force like while eating breakfast i just watched one episode of the second season it looks so freaking good like it just sounds it looks so amazing and the opening the first opening is by Imer and she's like is it Imer or Emer? I don't I don't know how to pronounce her name I just love her I've been loving her for years so about love and focus basically about this girl who is obsessed with photography because of her grandfather moves into this boarding house so she can go to this uh, high school they have where they have a professional photography club and all the people like in the in the boarding school uh, in the boarding house they're all just members of the photography club as well and she starts living there i've been really wanting to read like a manga about a boarding house i really wanted like because of reading living room matsunaga san i've been in that mood but i can't find living room matsunaga san like anywhere uh that delivers to here so yeah that's been great fire force is great as well there's nothing much to update in all honesty i was supposed to film today but i don't think i can because of my uh exam i just really want to study and finish it also do you like my new vest do you like it thank you so yeah there's i have to study 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 today this was my update thank you guys I hope you're having a wonderful day. I hope your week is very productive. Unlike me, I just feel like I've been scrambling around and not knowing what to do. So yeah, I'll leave it to you guys later. I'm gonna go study now. Bye. Stop. Don't please stop.
lovelies so i finally finished love and focus and i just wanted to tell you guys about my thoughts about this so this is a three volume manga meaning it is complete by yoko nigiri who is the same mangaka as that wolf uh, is mine and they also have a new series coming out in 2021 i'll put a picture right here i don't exactly remember the name but i saw the cover and it's really adorable Shoujo manga about this girl who is suffering from grief because of the death of her grandfather and so she tries to run away like kind of from home um not run away but she just doesn't want to like stay at home because it reminds her of her grandfather and so she goes to hokkaido she lives in sapporo uh, she's a great photographer and she learned like everything about photography from her grandfather she's a really successful photographer and she's won like a lot of awards I love that about our main character she's very successful and straightforward and really knows what she wants and goes after it and in their boarding house there is her childhood friends who has invited her to go there and then she meets the other members of the photography club where they all like live in that boarding house and slowly you know she starts to get to know them and the other members and stuff like that it's a really fun manga the art at the beginning like i don't know i felt like by the third volume it became better it's a little too simplified for me like um it's a very clean kind of art but i wish like it was better but i did feel like it improved a lot between the first and the third uh, volume for some reason it was just in the third volume very aesthetically pleasing and very like nice angles i don't know like they were just very they had a certain vibe to them but anyway i recommend this manga if you've been reading shoujo for a long time or if you've been reading manga in general for a long time and you just want like something cute like, uh, something to get you out of the slump because this is just a three volume manga and it's a very fast read i liked how the characters how we get the story like from the perspective of a female lead and sometimes it shifts to the male lead as well so i really like that we get this part of the story as well but i i really liked it I don't recommend it for beginners somehow because I just don't feel like it's gonna impress them like the manga is good but if I want a beginner to read manga I want them to read something like amazing that will make them like impressed with it you know it doesn't like give a lasting feeling like it's just adorable and cute and um, a good read like I liked it I'm giving it four stars I think I'm gonna end the vlog here I'm gonna go now and just watch Fire Force for the rest of the day Thank you so much for watching and I'm so sorry if this vlog was all over the place as usual and if I was so moody <laughs> uh, But yeah, thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye bye Baby. I'll go in I'll